Maybe I just go press the button again. Just kidding, I'm so- I still love these cosmetics. They are beautiful. It's all the way that way. Where do I gotta go for this? I have to go all the way here. Hey man, I'm supposed to speak to you about something. Have you seen boots called a Abyssal Galoshes? On your journey, a pirate stole them. I can't read your text. I might have the boots, actually. I just realized I probably do have them and I needed to bring them for this quest, don't I? You're wearing the boots. Oh. <laughs> hey, I got the boots right here, in fact. I see you have the infamous galoshes with you, but do you even know half of the story of, the, of them? Nobody knows why they decided to hide the boots. Just after they got into my father's hands, it was told they were acquired from uh, a strange man with pale gray skin. <gasps> Lord Volt! Ever since that filthy pirate raided our home and stole our treasures, weird things have been happening. If I allow you to enter my home, would you talk to him? No. They are strange- there are strange things going on in the mansion. And I hope that book reveals everything we need to know. Ah, Grandun! Grandion? Grand- whatever your name is. The book is a, actually a diary written by our ancestors decades ago. It is actually very interesting how they remodeled the, almost the whole house. The boots were apparently so valuable that the creature as part of the deal said they put some kind of spell on them. But that was a lie. It was found that the boots themselves were horrendously powerful, imbued with dark magic. I forgot that these were those boots. The writer of this diary wrote down some hints as to how to get rid of them. Maybe you could find out what they mean. Here, try this one. The face above the hall owns the nose that needs to be heavier to open the way. What? There's something behind the map on the wall to uncover a piece of the code. Wait, you probably mean the code in the basement. Aha! Two is the, sh is the second. Okay. What am I supposed to do about this big freaking nose, man? Jump down, it opened a hole behind the villager. Oh, I see, I see. Ah! That's very quiet. Probably because I have my block sounds down. I would have heard that more than likely. Look to the stone in the floor in what? In the floor in the corner to reveal the dining table secrets. Aha! Another pressure plate. I definitely did something, right? Yeah, right here. Okay. It okay. I gotta be quicker than that. Got it, got it, got it. Then it probably drops me in, and okay, I should talk to him first, I guess. A room hidden underneath the big head? Why didn't I think of that? I was wondering how self-centered they had to be to put that in. Seems they guessed that we would have to search for a way to return the boots, and made preparations. As I said, the stairs are all broken. I mean, I certainly couldn't climb up the rotten scraps of wood. I suppose it might be the best look for the stone, hmm? Carpet of a different color will show you the stone to reveal the tab table secrets. I already found it. To open the passage above the flags, look at the corner to a hole that no one wanted. Never would have imagined any of this in the house. Anyways, there was a message. What did it say? You mean no one's randomly stood in that corner there and had that block? Whatever. Bop. Okay, so press that, and then I run my appy ass over to here, and then I quickly park. Oh, maybe I just go press the button again. Just kidding, I'm so- Hi, hello? H hello? Is there some, uh, lady stuck up here? Darn, I thought for sure one of these books would open a secret shelf. Oh, hey, uh, Humi? Oh, wow, Secret Passage, not as impressive as getting to climb the way up, but still, nice job. I'm guessing that you're looking for the code hints, yes. Plus, I lost my notebook, so I can't even write down my notes. I just put it on the pillow in the master bedroom for two seconds, and then it disappeared. This is- and, oh god, I'm just gonna take these out as my throwing items. No? Aha! Eight is the fourth. What's up here? Do they... to solve? Aha! It's not... Oh, wait. He told us that the blue flowers are special. <gasps> oh, shit, dude. The blue flowers. The flowers were right there with a button. Oh, this wasn't here. Oh, hey! Ah, that was easy. Six, two, one, eight. Easy. It is loud. Oh, I got this way. Aha! Did I get it? I got it! I'm out of here, nerds! Bye! You found the container! I wish I could have gone with you, except I don't! 
That was easy. I uh, still cannot believe that such a small thing could cause so much trouble. Well, I cannot just let you stand there without a reward, right? Yeah, my hand's feeling a little empty. You should fill it. Hey, he gave me replacement boots for the boots that he stole. Those boots are actually pretty good, especially the mana regen. Fair, fair. No, I probably want more mana regen on this. The lifesteal and health regen are decent. Uh, I probably want slightly better. We're going to try again. I think I just leave them as it is. It's more like in between. The life regen's still good, or the life steal is still good. Uh, it's got a little more of everything else. I think it's good. Hello, good sir. Oh, hello there. I was, uh, I had hoped not to bother you, adventure, but this is urgent. You see, the king's son has gone missing, and with him worrying so much, the problems of the city have festered unsolved. We believe he had, was kidnapped by the Splinter Cell mercenaries in the jungle. Go there and see what they want in return for the young prince. How about a, a spear to the spleen or a cello to the head? What are you doing here? How did you find our secret hideout outside of town in the giant cave beside a farm? Oh, you're here for the boy. A mighty fine steal, that one. Ah, but what to have you fetch? Oh, ha ha. This would be a perfect opportunity to obtain that. There's a certain talisman that we aren't able to get to in the temple not far from here. It has special abilities that allow me, um, what? Allow my men to be strengthened, see? You get that talisman in my hands and the king's boy is yours. These guys look very upset and they don't, I don't think they like me. Well, this is super easy. They really couldn't do this themselves, I guess. Hey man, do I like attack you? I'm gonna go with I'm gonna go with, yeah, I attack you. And I get a talisman. Wow, amazing. It's so cool. He really wanted this? Excuse me, I brought your stupid talisman back. At this point, I would usually keep the, the kid and throw you out of here. But since you've done what I've asked in such a timely fashion, he's all yours. Tell them to leave my men and I alone. My guildsmen lay down our lives every day. We don't need any more hostile onlookers. Then... We don't need any more hostile onlookers yet. We're gonna kidnap a kid. Like, what the fuck is wrong with you? Why did you free me? I'm trying to run away. I hate being the son of the king. Oh. It's not like my father ever listened to me when I told him he wouldn't even let me out of the castle. Could you please tell Yavilus that I want to be free? I'd be grateful if you could. Oh, God. Okay, well, this is going interestingly. It's like, I want to be a great mercenary like the ones that supposedly kidnapped me. Ah, finally you're back. Did you let- uh, did- did they let you bring him back? He truly wants to be a mercenary. Oh my, then he must have escaped on his own. I only hope that he chooses to join them out of will to protect the people rather than simply brutish- brutishness or money. I definitely wanted blood pack. No, did I? I don't fucking know. Thing is, I need to get one more thing in the fallen archetype. You know what, let's get comment. I can always respect if I change my mind later. Did you hear about some guy wandering around town? I've heard strange rumors about him. Hey, stranger, how long have you been listening to us? Did your mom teach you any manners? Well, I've been listening to you for about six texts of dialogue. This might be our only chance to really know who this mystery man really is. So this is what we're looking for. We're looking for some, some door in... What the? This house is massive. All right, we're going down the long hallway of hallwayness. Or do we go up here and find absolutely nothing? Because there's nothing up here. Hello, stranger. Welcome to my humble wooden, uh, hu friendly neighborhood neighbor man here. What do you need for uh, me for? Kidnappings? Poaching? Not brushing my teeth? Who is this lowly person you're talking about? They don't seem to be a nice fellow such as myself. So you must be thinking. How have you never met a fine fellow such as myself until now? The, oh, the places I've been were, <laughs> were wonderful. From the depth of the jungle to the lesser depths of the jungle to even the ba my back garden, I've done my fair sharing of exploring, if I do say so myself. I'm such a normal guy, Mr. Neighborly Neighborhood Neighbor Man. Here we're at the library. I could spend years in here, but who has the time for that, right? I could talk about books for hours, too. There's one right now. We're here now. Take the exit right in front of you. Don't mind the corner to the right. It's only for decoration. The ground is shaking. I thought that was supposed to happen later. Come back, friend. I can't do this alone. Deep to the sides. It's safer that way. Just stay here for one moment. Eh. Oh, shit, man. 
During the shaking, some of the machines broke apart, but we could use these to build something capable of dropping something heavier on your head for a second time. What the fuck is this quest? Okay, so I'm using the machines to slowly move things over. What? That's not gonna work. Let's see what happens. That falls, hits that. To the cart. I'm sure there's a right way to do this. I'm just an idiot and I have no fucking clue. And that should shoot it up, hit this cannon, go and shoot up to there. Which then I will do a cart at five. And that sends it to Hammer. Hammer sends it onto my head! I nailed it! I'm so smart, kind of. Quick, head through the large door and stop uh, the cause of all this shaking. Hey, guys. Uh, what's going on? Do I take this over to here? Insert key. I do. Okay. Did it, like, uppercut and then spike him back down? That's awesome. And problem solved. Big plant be dead. Right? Oh, no, no. This is not good. If I had known that my little pet uh, has grown so much, I would have uh, rushed you out sooner. Now it is wilted. You did what you had to, though. Uh, I am sorry to say this, friend, but I think I'll stay inside a little longer. Sorry, my only friend. Man, that sure was uh, an interesting quest. Oh, boy. I... I'm so confused, and also, that puzzle... I mean, that was a cool puzzle, don't get me wrong, but holy shit, my brain is fried. Thanks to you, we solved the case of the mystery man, as well as the mystery house. For this, I'd like to welcome you to the club. New member, here is your shiny new badge that you can parade around town to show off how cool you are. Others, uh, That's where I'm gonna go and end this one. I hope you guys did enjoy. It was a weird one. If you did, leave a like on it, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one.